Hello, EN100 students, and welcome to week 13 of EN100. Here's what you're supposed to do this week. Uh, you already, it's already been up on Classroom for a little bit, uh, but basically you're going to be focusing on your third draft of your observation essay. Uh, Non-dual credit students, I recorded my feedback and sent that to you. It's in the comments of that second draft essay. Look at it and readjust your essay like so. Uh, the important thing to keep in mind is the revision self-analysis. Uh, I recorded a video talking about the portfolio final that will be due the first couple weeks of December. And this assignment right here, the revision self-analysis, is a big player when it comes to understanding uh, are being able to help you with this portfolio because basically the portfolio is asking you to reflect on your decision making process and your writing process throughout the entire semester you're not going to remember that all at the very end of the year here so these are going to help you like whenever you did this for the literacy narrative you can go back and look at that and that will help you with the portfolio just like this right here as you're writing this essay as soon as you get done coming up of your third draft, you go in and you do your revision self-analysis and that will help you with your portfolio. Now, this is actually a 20 point assignment that you do need to do regardless if you do a third draft or not. So revision self-reflection, uh, in addition to writing and revising the essay, you'll need to turn in a two page or 400 word uh, discussion of your choices that you made in drafting and revising your essay. Why did you choose the style you did? What, or, what about organization? Uh, why are the specific paragraphs linked together? Or why did you include specific sections of the essay? Basically be aware of your writing process and the discussion and decisions you are making. Similarly, you will also talk about the revisions you made. Uh, why did you change things you did? And why did you change them in the way that you did? You obviously have a little bit of freedom with this assignment based on your own piece of writing but the main thing is that you are thinking about and discussing the decisions you are making as a writer uh, make sure to discuss both the positive and negative this will help you identify what does and doesn't make your uh, work in your own writing and what does and doesn't amount to effective revision in your written work in addition to those benefits you will also be coming a uh, come the end of the semester, which is coming up, which I talked about, which I pointed to the video that none of y'all watch. None of y'all watch my portfolio video. And I explained the por what you need to do and whatnot. But you will, uh, you'll have to assemble a portfolio of your writings throughout the semester, complete a new piece of writing, which critically analyzes your own performance in the course. These re self re reflections about each individual essay will provide quite, will be, prove quite useful as you will be able to easily look back at your performance and what led you there rather than to remember it all at the end. Your self-reflection is due no later than the due date for the optional third draft of your corresponding essay, which we have pointed out is due on Sunday, this Sunday. This Sunday you have two assignments due, which is this revision self-analysis and the third draft of that essay. I'm uh, uh, since, uh, how the, uh, here's, all right. Hope you all, you all watch this because I'm going to explain what's going on. You have an assignment that is due over Thanksgiving break week. We'll talk about that here in a moment. Or not in a moment. I'll record another video for week 14 because I'll just post the week 14 stuff as we uh, just to, so you can get a head start. You can do it this week and not next week. And because you have assignments over Thanksgiving break, you don't, your last day in this class is essentially December the 9th. So you have like the last two weeks of school, you are free to do whatever, uh, as long as it's appropriate in school, you know, but because uh, we still have two more weeks we have to roll, but your class, your EN 100 class is done December the 9th. So even though you're like, boo hoo, what do I have to do more go over Thanksgiving break? On December 9th, you're donezo. You are donezo with a capital D, all right? So to help you out with that, I'm going to record another video almost after I this out that talks about what to do for that week and I'll post the assignments for that week, okay? So this week I need to really focus is the third draft of the observation essay. And then you, after you're done with your third draft and your revision self-analysis, then you focus on week 14, okay? All right, I will see y'all. I will see the Zoom meeting here in just like a minute or two, and I will see all of y'all later. Bye-bye.